got we got richest guy in Broward County. Up? That's his truck right over there on Portiano. Yeah, yeah. I just bought that. You just bought that. Cash <laughs> yeah. me out. Cash me out, dude. Thomas is selling everything. James is buying everything. So <laughs> oh, yeah. Whatever you got. Whatever you got. He won't big at the Hard Rock. Dude, look. This guy. Look right there. Put a the camera on that guy. He's he's about to shoot the video again. Six is on the Cummins. What do you think? James, you're buying these or what? Yeah, yeah. I'll buy them. <laughs> I think they were going on the Polaris. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Some burnout slitter. Got, got the whole crew here today, huh? It's my personal personal vehicle you guys never seen before, but it's a 1500, but diesel. 1500 body out there. We got the hardest Jeep in town right here. Cameraman Kev, okay, you gotta give the walk there on this. You gotta give the walk there. The walk there. Walk, quick walk there on this right here. All right, so it's it. on 24 by 14s on 40 by 1550s. We got a four and a half inch Evo lift with Falcon shocks all the way around, fully adjustable. It's got the upgraded steering kit, got some rigid lights. Uh, got the color match bumper, color match fenders. It's got the custom stickers on there, and it is a diesel, oh, eco diesel, brand new big diesel guy in the G2021. And if you come back here. We got different fenders back here, color match too. We got the color match bumper, and we also have the upgraded uh, tire rack kit. You did all the paint, right? Yep, we did it all ourselves in the backyard. So the wheels are powdered, and the, all the suspension is painted. So it's crazy, absolutely crazy. All right, let's go. Let's hit the Duramax. Walk through on the Duramax, dude. I know you're a big Duramax guy now. Just got this Duramax. It's just on a little two-inch level. 2212 yellow forces actually. Oh, That's yellow, custom. dude. I like yellow. yellow. And then the uh, boost auto mirrors. That's pretty much it. Damn, bro. You gotta give our dog Soflo Retro a little shout out. Soflo Retro is in the mirrors. I wire them, hook them up. That's about it. It has a small towing tune on it, tune deleted. Four inch inch sale, six inch ship. Is it for sale? Is it for sale? Yeah, oh, yeah. It's Every for sale, percent. yeah. 30 grand or best offer, you know, not too bad. Yeah. Well, the people want to see if they can do a burnout before they buy it. So they already oh, see she does burnout. We gotta, we gotta check out the 4Gs. The new 4G out there. This guy's going fishing right now. So you might not know. Uh, DJ Frog's out here in the hottest time of the day. <laughs> he just said, hey, uh, I'm coming at 1. Got here at 3. Dude, excuse the audio here. He, he likes to park next to the ventilation. In the shade. Too hot. The 4Gs are too hot. 26, 16, Forgiados on 35, 14, 50 Venoms. Dude, I don't know if you guys seen, but these wheels just hit the market. Thomas hopped on, first one to ever buy them, put them on the truck. Forgiato off-road, Forge wheels. For sale. For sale, oh, everything. Everything, everything for, for sale. sale. Whole truck or just the wheels and tires. <laughs> yeah. and then, what do you think about these tires, bro? They're the hard best, looking Best pattern. tire I've ever rode on. Best tire you ever rode on? Yeah, yeah. Good investment. Uh, everybody on the channel, look, everybody has Furies. Only one person here right now, but uh, Venom tires look way harder, bro. Hey man, Jeep's on Toyos. Jeep's on yeah. Toyos. Oh, oh that's, that's a flex. flex. <laughs> that's a flex. <laughs> We're not on that level, dude. Oh, maybe this guy. Put, put the camera on this guy. Big Platinum. Platinum Illuminated. That's coming up for this thing. The secret, bro. It's a secret. Everything's a secret, dude, bro. We know what kind of boat you have. It's not a secret. Put it on the... He's going with the polished fender. Dude, what do you think, James? You're buying these or what? I don't know, man. I think I'll stick with my 2212 <laughs> horses. Uh, we got a nice trade set up for you. This whole thing was here for a trade. Yeah? Ford Yacht was right over there. Oh, that's right. All right, so we're filming this video, but this truck's being sold tomorrow, so unless you got a higher offer, you come in right now. What's up, guys? It's PJ Trucking. Welcome back to the channel. If you're new, thanks for clicking on. If you've been following along, appreciate all the support. Today we got a sick 2021 Illuma Duty. We're gonna hop in. Before we get in on that, I just wanna let you guys know we've been working on a pretty dope project. It'll be coming out pretty soon. So stay tuned for that and let's hop in. So right here we got a 2021 Illuma Duty. It's leveled on 26 by 16s on 35s. We got 35 by 1550 26 Fury Country Herner MTs. How do you like them? Yeah, they're alright? Yeah. First guy that ever says they're alright, usually everybody says they suck. On 26 by 16 specialty forge wheels. 
the truck's sitting on a leveling kit and as you can see I think it's a perfect I think it's the perfect setup you could have right here for an Illumina Duty unless you want to take it to the next level so sitting on a level sitting on no spacers he does rub so in case you were thinking about running this setup it does rub a little bit like I said you could go the four inch route you'll probably still rub or you could go a big lift and that will take care of your problem let's hop into the paint match really quick all the paint match was done by SoFlo Retros only the best you got paint to match headlights paint to match grill Ford ovals and mirror caps and let's hop to the side over here we got paint to match fender badges left the platinum and the letters chrome everything else is black top of mirror caps black we'll hop into the back real quick it's actually pretty cool we have a black platinum plaque paint to match whatever you call it paint to match platinum plaque and I think it's pretty cool when you black it out like this it's kind of like subtle, subtle flex then we got paint match ovals right here and obviously you see the exhaust tuning deleted so far on the channel we've only had one Illuma Duty that wasn't deleted and he still was able to do a burnout but not as big as potential right here so let's hop into the interior real quick we got clean super clean platinum interior obviously when you have a platinum it's a 21 big infotainment center sunroof it's got the full roof real quick if you guys are watching from the last video let me know how you guys feel about having factory suede headliner versus putting in your own suede headliner some people were talking about how they prefer putting in their own suede versus the limited suede headliner also right here we have a two-wheel drive valence a lot of people swap out from the four-wheel drive just because the four-wheel drive is so big and bulky and obviously the rubbing will be double of what you rub on the usual uh, other than that we just got a sick Illumina Duty. I, I personally like the level on 26's a lot more than like a 4 inch or a 6 inch on 26's but obviously way different style than 8 inch or 10 inch on 26's. Alright, probably the coolest part about this truck is the all black look with a couple chrome accents. On the windshield he's got 35% tint, on the sides he's got 5% tint and if you just look the truck just looks awesome. Usually some people with the Platinum, they like to keep these pieces right here, like that Platinum brush or whatever. He blacked it all out and left the oval, black, chrome and black, chrome letters. 6-7 Marco, that's what we were planning to do. I think it looks absolutely killer. I don't think I would change anything on this truck, unless you went the other route on my big lift. So let's see if we can get this guy to do a little burnout, since it is deleted. Alright, so this truck is deleted. It's got a Frankie tune. It's supposed to add about 175 horsepower. I'm going to turn it on real quick so you guys can get a quick sound clip. Maybe get some burnouts. I need one of these so bad. Fuck, dude. It's so sick. I didn't even know it had like this red. I don't know if you can see. Like it's got red stitching all on the seats too. You good? Lumi Duty we have on the channel does sound the same. For some reason, this one sounds like it has a little more whistle. I think it just depends on who tunes it. This is a Frankie tune. I'm gonna let her eat a little bit so you can hear outside. smoke back there last one uh, all right well this is my guy right here try to see if you can do a little burnout on the channel no truck ever comes on and doesn't do a burnout so. all right bro no truck ever comes on the channel and doesn't do a burnout <laughs> so you gotta give us a little burnout not even a little spin bro all right we gotta see what we gotta see what fisherman thomas over here has got to say about this truck. thomas what do you think i don't know did you know about this bird car man we also got train horns right in front one glass of fan horns. How many tanks? One tank? Two tanks. Got two tanks and fan horns. Yo, good. 
Robert, what'd you say? James, when you buy one of these, I'll buy it off you. I'll buy it. <laughs> this shit's so fucking hard, dude. So fucking. Burnout. There you go, he can do a burnout. So, Kevin, every video. Alright, guys, appreciate you guys watching. Every week we drop a sick truck of the week. We got a guy on 14, richest guy, yeah, richest people in Brown County here. So, alright, appreciate you guys watching. Stay tuned, big projects coming soon. Every Monday, sick truck of the week. Stay tuned, PJ Trucking. Subscribe. <laughs>